Welcome to the U.S. Military Summary Channel. As the conflict in Ukraine escalates, today we will compare two strategic missiles, the U.S. ATA CMS and the Russian Iskander, to see which missile may be more powerful if used in combat. Let's explore in this video. Strategic missiles play an important role in ensuring national security and power balance between superpowers. Among them, the U.S. ATA CMS and the Russian Iskander are both outstanding strategic missiles used in many military campaigns. ATA CMS, short for Army Tactical Missile System, is the U.S. mid-range missile system developed since the 1980s. With a length of 6.2 meters, a diameter of 610 millimeters and a combat load from 230 to 450 kilograms, ATA CMS has a range of 300 kilometers to 500 kilometers. The accuracy of ATA CMS is very high, with a circular error probable CEP, of only about 10 meters, allowing the missile to attack sensitive and important targets. Meanwhile, Iskander is Russia's mid-range missile system, developed since the 1990s. Iskander has a length of 7.3 meters, a diameter of 920 millimeters, and a combat load from 480 to 700 kilograms. The range of Iskander ranges from 280 to 500 kilograms, depending on whether it's the Iskander E or Iskander M version. The accuracy of Iskander is also impressive, with a CEP of only about 5 to 7 meters. Development History the development history of ATA CMS US and Iskander Russia is closely tied to the efforts to enhance the combat capabilities of these two superpowers. ATA CMS developed by Lockheed Martin in the 1980s is part of the US strategic missile program. Over the years ATA CMS has undergone multiple upgrades with the latest version being the Block IA unitary MGM-168 capable of destroying single targets. On the other hand, Iskander developed by KB Mashinostraninia in the 1990s was designed to replace Russia's Scud medium-range missile system. Iskander has two main versions, Iskander M SS-26 Stone for the Russian military and Iskander E for export. Both ATA CMS and Iskander missile systems have undergone numerous upgrades and technological developments making them important strategic missile systems in the U.S. and Russian military. Technical Characteristics In Ukraine, the conflict is escalating, and the two types of strategic missiles, the U.S. ATA CMS and the Russian Iskander, could be deployed. To help you better understand them, below is a technical comparison of the two missiles. The ATA CMS missile has a length of 6.15 meters, a diameter of 610 millimeters, a weight of 1,750 kilograms and a warhead of 500 kilograms. The range of ATA CMS is 165 kilometers for the Block 1 version and 300 kilometers for the Block IA version. The accuracy of ATA CMS is evaluated through the Circular Error Probable CEP index of about 10 meters. The positioning and control system of ATA CMS includes a GPS positioning system and an INS, Inertial Navigation System, Flight Control System. On the other hand, the Iskander missile has a length of 7.3 meters, a diameter of 920 millimeters, a weight of 4,615 kilograms, and a warhead of 480 to 700 kilograms. The range of Iskander is 400 to 500 kilometers for the Iskander M version, and 280 kilometers for the Iskander E version. The accuracy of Iskander is also evaluated through the Circular Error Probable CEP index, but it is about 5 to 7 meters, higher than ATA CMS. The positioning and control system of Iskander includes a GLONASS GPS positioning system and an INS, Inertial Navigation System, Flight Control System. Overall, both missiles have impressive technical characteristics, but Iskander has a longer range and higher accuracy than ATA CMS. Combat Capabilities ATA CMS, a strategic missile system of the US, is capable of attacking targets such as infrastructure, radar stations, command centers, assembly areas, and airports. 
With its fast speed and low flight altitude, ATACMS reduces the likelihood of detection and interception, demonstrating a significant anti-aircraft capability. ATACMS has been used in modern conflicts such as the Gulf War and the Iraq War, proving its effectiveness in reality. Meanwhile, Iskander, a strategic missile system of Russia, can attack similar targets as ATACMS, but also adds naval vessels to its list. Iskander stands out with its fast flight, flexible mobility, and the ability to evade modern anti-aircraft systems, demonstrating superiority in the field of anti-aircraft defense. However, Iskander has not been used in actual conflicts, but is still considered one of the most effective strategic missile systems. When comparing ATACMS and Iskander, both types of missiles have their own unique characteristics and capabilities, suitable for the tactics and security requirements of each country using them. ATACMS has the advantage of having been tested in actual conflicts, while Iskander has superior anti-aircraft capabilities. Strengths and Weaknesses The Strength and Weaknesses of ATACMS and Iskander ATACMS, or Army Tactical Missile System of the U.S., has notable advantages such as high accuracy, flexibility in deployment and use, as well as proven performance in actual conflicts such as the Gulf War and the Iraq War. However, ATACMS also has the disadvantage of a lower range compared to Iskander, only about 300 kilometers, and cannot switch between different types of warheads. Iskander, a mid-range missile system of Russia, has outstanding advantages such as a longer range than the ATACMS, 400 to 500 kilometers for the Iskander M version and 280 kilometers for the Iskander E version. Better anti-aircraft capability thanks to its high speed and flexible movement, as well as the ability to switch between different types of warheads. However, Iskander has not been proven in actual conflicts, and the export of this type of missile is hindered by international treaties. Overall, both ATACMS and Iskander have their strengths and weaknesses, and the choice between the two depends on the specific needs and circumstances of the user. Conclusion After careful comparison and evaluation, both ATACMS and Iskander missile systems have their own advantages and disadvantages which are suitable for the tactics and security requirements of each country that uses them. ATACMS with high accuracy and proven effectiveness in actual conflicts such as the Gulf War and the Iraq War is considered an effective missile system. Meanwhile, Iskander has a longer range, up to 500 kilometers, and better anti-aircraft capabilities, allowing it to avoid modern air defense systems. ATACMS and Iskander both play an important role in strengthening the military power of the US and Russia. The development and deployment of these strategic missile systems demonstrate the increasing arms race among superpowers, while also impacting the balance of power and regional stability. Thus, ATACMS and Iskander not only demonstrate the advanced military technology, but also evidence significant changes in the current international context. Thank you for watching the video comparing the two strategic missile systems, ATACMS and Iskander. I hope the information in this video will help you better understand the strengths and role of each missile system in the current international context. If you find this video useful and interesting, don't forget to click the like button and share this video with your friends and family. To not miss the latest videos on military, defense technology, and in-depth analysis, subscribe to the U.S. Military Summary channel now. Wish you a good day and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.